Hello, hello, this is Rod, Live Within Your Means. I'll just move the butter out of the way here and show you uh, the grapes that I've been uh, trying to root. Now, I'm not going to say they have roots on them yet, um, but I did these back on the 11th, so it's been about 20 days, the 11th of March. And this one had the commercial root stimulant, and you see some of the leaves coming out here. They, they budded, leaves are coming out. Hopefully we'll get some roots that are going to start on there. One that I had dipped in aloe vera. Um, you'll see that there's a few of those coming out. Uh, this one had aspirin. You know, there's uh, I dipped them in you know acetylsalicylic acid, aspirin. And again, we've got some roots coming out. Not quite as prolific as, uh, if that's the word to use, as this with a root stimulant or the ones with the aloe vera, but pretty close. Here's one with vinegar. They were dipped in vinegar to use as a root stimulant. They look like they're coming along. Uh, this one here, these were dipped in honey. These cuttings were dipped in honey. And I don't see much. I do see, see that right back there. That's a bud coming out. So they are coming, but certainly not as well. And these have been just sitting here on the dryer in the kitchen. This one, where these were dipped in cinnamon to stimulate growth. You know, there's there's buds here. There's a, a bud that's, you know, turned into leaves right there. So all of these things seem to be starting to bud. Um, I think it's probably important to note that the honey worked the least well as a root stimulant. The vinegar did uh, seems they seem to be doing pretty well. The aspirin relatively well. That's the seal salicylic acid. The aloe vera seems to be doing well, and the one with the commercial root stimulant seems to be doing well. Um, it's probably also important to note here. I've got these uh, cuttings that were um, they're hazelnuts or filberts, and notice. Uh, I've got these in dirt here in some potting soil with commercial root stimulant there. And I see the buds coming out here. Hopefully they will develop uh, roots on them. And where these have got a couple of dozen of them here, maybe, well, around 20 of them. And hopefully these will be able to be planted as filbert trees, bushes, whatever you want to call them, because they grow multiple, multiple stems. But uh, these filberts or hazelnuts, uh, they seem to be, and I did these on the same, around the same time. I think it was the same day on the 11th of March. And you can see the, the leaf buds coming out here. So, kind of exciting to uh, be propagating plants, right? Plants that have uh, something edible. And these grapes were just absolutely wonderful, seedless, blue, kind of a black, blue, grape. So I'll be putting those very soon into uh, their own their own containers, each of them individually. So I'll be doing that pretty quick. And uh, if I see, you know, as I see the leaves coming on those, I'm going to be uh, putting those in their own containers so that they can continue to uh, uh, get the roots growing. But I don't want to do it just yet. I don't see enough of them out yet. And uh, anyway, yeah, so things are moving along, and uh, the daffodils are out. I picked these daffodils from some that I planted the bulbs, you know, a few years ago for my mother, and I liked picking some of these daffodils for my wife. Those are some flowers she got at work uh, from work colleagues for her birthday, and I picked a bunch of the daffodils for my mother too. I love daffodils; they're beautiful. And uh, anyhow. This is Rod, and uh, please subscribe if you will, if you'd like to, to the channel. And if you like this, give the give it a thumbs up, and put please put some comments below. And you're welcome to share these videos with others so we can get this uh, channel going and and get good things that'll be shared with others. Hopefully, I'll become a little bit more entertaining <laughs> and put some good things out there for you. So this is Rod. Live within your means and have a wonderful day.